In the infinity of the cosmos lies a mystery that challenges our understanding of existence, dark energy and unseen force propelling the universe's expansion at an unimaginable pace. Yet against all odds our universe is delicately balanced, nurturing the emergence of life. Is this precise orchestration a mere coincidence, or evidence of an intelligent design? Join us on a journey to unlock the secrets behind the universe's existence and our place within it. Dive deep into the mysteries of the cosmos, subscribe and explore the universe's greatest enigmas with us. Welcome to Quantum Mind. To understand the behavior of our universe, we turn to Einstein's theory of general relativity. This theory, proposed by Albert Einstein in the early 20th century, fundamentally changed how we perceive the universe. It tells us that what we experience as gravity is actually the curvature of space and time around massive objects. Imagine you're on a giant stretched out trampoline. In its center sits a heavy bowling ball, causing the fabric to sag and form a deep curve around it. This curve represents the bending of space by gravity. Now picture yourself gently rolling a small marble along the edge of this curve. Instead of moving in a straight line, the marble curves and spirals inward, drawn towards the bowling ball. This movement mimics how planets orbit around stars due to the curvature of space caused by gravity. This is a simplified but useful analogy to understand how space and time curve around massive objects, causing what we perceive as gravity. But general relativity doesn't just apply to planets, stars and galaxies, it's also a key player in the grand theater of the universe. You see, it explains why and how the universe expands. The cosmos isn't just a static stage where galaxies move apart like ships on a sea. Instead, space itself is dynamic, it stretches, it evolves. Visualize placing a loaf of raisin bread dough into the oven. As it heats up, the dough begins to rise and expand. Watch as the raisins, once close together, slowly drift apart, each moving away from its neighbors. This is akin to the galaxies in our universe. As the universe itself stretches and grows, galaxies are carried along with this expansion, moving away from each other. It's not that the galaxies are traveling through space on their own, rather, the fabric of space itself is expanding, pulling the galaxies along with it. And here's where things get really interesting. Observations show that this expansion isn't slowing down, as one might intuitively expect. Instead, it's speeding up. It's as if our raisin bread dough is growing faster and faster in the oven, an idea that was quite revolutionary when first proposed. This accelerated cosmic expansion is one of the fascinating and mysterious phenomena that scientists are still trying to understand. They believe it's driven by something we can't see, something we can't touch, but something that makes up about 70% of the universe, dark energy. But for life to exist, the universe must walk a fine line. Let's explore this delicate balance. Energy density and pressure, two key players in the grand theater of space-time. Let's dive into the cosmic ballet where energy density and pressure pirouette in a delicate dance, governing the dynamics of our universe. Energy density, simply put, is the amount of energy stored in a given system or region of space. Pressure, on the other hand, is the force exerted by energy or matter. Together, they choreograph the expansion and evolution of the universe. The cosmos, vast and mysterious, is not as chaotic as it might seem. It's actually a well-orchestrated symphony, maintaining a delicate balance, a balance that is essential for life as we know it. Imagine if the energy density was significantly greater than it is. The gravitational pull would be so strong that the universe would collapse back onto itself. A big crunch, if you will. Now consider the opposite scenario where the energy density is a lot less. The universe would expand so rapidly that atoms, stars, and galaxies wouldn't have had the chance to form. But here we are, living in a universe that seems to have hit the sweet spot where the rate of expansion allowed galaxies and stars to form and eventually, life to emerge. Pressure plays an equally significant role. In the cosmological equation, pressure can have a positive or negative value. Positive pressure slows down the expansion, while negative pressure, like that caused by dark energy, accelerates it. What's fascinating is that the universe appears to have struck a remarkable balance between these factors. The energy density and pressure have been so finely tuned that they've allowed the cosmos to unfold in a way that supports life. This exquisite balance, this cosmic harmony, 
raises intriguing questions. Is it purely coincidental, or does it hint at a grand design, a cosmic architect pulling the strings? But the theoretical predictions of the energy density of the universe and the reality we observe show a vast discrepancy. Let's find out why. Quantum field theory paints a picture of the universe, but does this picture match our reality? This is where theoretical predictions and reality often don't see eye to eye. Quantum field theory, our best attempt at understanding the fundamental nature of the universe makes predictions about dark energy density. It suggests an energy density so enormous, we might as well be living inside a black hole, but is that what we observe? Not quite. Our actual observations tell a different story. When astronomers look out into the universe, they find the energy density to be astonishingly lower than what quantum field theory predicts. This discrepancy is not just a minor hiccup. It's a discrepancy of around 120 orders of magnitude. That's like predicting the height of a skyscraper and ending up with a measurement closer to the size of an atom. This raises a crucial question. Why is there such a colossal difference between prediction and observation? Is our understanding of the universe fundamentally flawed, or is there something we're missing? This inconsistency has significant implications for the structure and fate of the universe. If the density of dark energy were as high as initially predicted, it would lead to an incredibly rapid expansion, tearing apart galaxies, stars, even atoms, before they could form. Life as we know it would be impossible. But instead we find ourselves in a universe that seems to be finely tuned for life, with an expansion rate just right for the formation of galaxies, stars, and ultimately, us. This discrepancy between theoretical predictions and observed reality is one of the biggest unsolved mysteries in cosmology. It's like a cosmic puzzle that we're still trying to piece together. And every new discovery adds another piece to this grand cosmic jigsaw. This takes us to the big question. Are the fine-tuned conditions of our universe a product of coincidence or indicative of intelligent design? As we continue our journey through the cosmos, this question will guide our exploration, challenging our understanding of the universe and our place within it. Could there be a grand designer behind the finely tuned universe we inhabit? As we delve deeper into the mysteries of our cosmos, we encounter a thought-provoking possibility. The conditions within our universe are so finely balanced that it almost seems like a grand design, a cosmic blueprint if you will. But is this balance a mere product of coincidence? Or is it indicative of intelligent design? Let's explore some theories that attempt to explain this cosmic equilibrium. One such theory is the multiverse theory. Advocates of this theory suggest that our universe is just one among a virtually infinite number of universes, each with its own unique set of physical laws. In such a vast multiverse, it's plausible that at least one universe, like ours, would possess the right conditions for life purely by chance. But there's a catch. The multiverse theory, while fascinating, is still largely speculative. It hasn't been empirically confirmed and indeed it might never be. So, while it offers a possible explanation for our universe's fine-tuning, it leaves us with more questions than answers. Another theory points to the role of undiscovered particles. Some physicists propose that unknown particles or forces might be at play, influencing the structure of our universe in ways we don't yet understand. This theory, while interesting, is also speculative and currently lacks empirical support. So, we find ourselves at an intriguing crossroads. On one hand, we have the remarkable balance of our universe, which seems almost too perfect to be a product of mere chance. On the other hand, we have theories that attempt to explain this balance, but these theories are, as of now, speculative. So, we return to our original question. Is our universe a product of coincidence, or is there an intelligent designer at work? As we marvel at our existence within such a finely balanced universe, we invite you to ponder the possibility of other surprises the universe may hold and the ongoing quest to understand our place within it. Before we conclude, let's take a moment to reflect on our journey. We've delved into the intricacies of general relativity and cosmic expansion, explored the delicate balance of our universe, pondered the tension between theoretical predictions and reality, and questioned the possibility of an intelligent design behind it all. Each of these topics is a testament to our quest for knowledge, a testament to our insatiable curiosity. But even as we unravel the mysteries of the universe, let's not forget that there's still so much more to discover. The cosmos is vast and filled with wonders that we've yet to comprehend, so we encourage you to continue exploring, to continue questioning, to continue seeking answers. As Carl Sagan once said, 
somewhere something incredible is waiting to be known. A heartfelt thank you for joining us on this journey. Your time, your attention, your curiosity, they're what drive us to continue creating these videos and remember, the universe is full of surprises so until next time, keep looking up.